The year is now 2020. The world is full of corruption and ignorance. Humans have overpopulated the earth, and almost all species of animals are endangered. It is for this reason that animals have been placed with their specific orders in national parks that have been created for the sole purpose of their survival. These parks are scattered all throughout the globe and have been able to drastically increase the animal's rate of survival. However, one man will stop at nothing to get what he wants, no matter what the consequences are. Listen, Dimitri, to drill for uranium, we will need to obliterate the Mammalia National Park. That location, and that location only can serve the purpose. All you need to do is think of how we're going to do it. The animals must go, whatever the price. How about we just drop a bomb on them? No, 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 Dimitri. That would never work. We need something else, a different way to get rid of the problem. These animals give me nothing but trouble. I need more space for my business. Don't worry, I'll have our men take care of the problem. Make sure it is done. As you should probably know by now, there are no second chances. What? Dante, get him! What are you doing here? Answer me! Take him to interrogation. I want to talk to him by tomorrow. Go get him. I'll wait here. Agent Ethan Hunt, I know you want to do this by yourself, but one can never have too much help. We have just located the remaining three animals that Sergei Kristoff is trying to eliminate. They're all located somewhere in this national park. Their first target is the bear. Your mission, should you choose to accept it, is to stop Sergei's henchmen from killing the bears from the Order Carnivora. As always, should you or any member of your team be caught or killed, the Secretary will disavow any knowledge of your actions. This message will self-destruct in five seconds. We have another mission. Looks like we're gonna be in another tough fight. I'll be in the van like always, monitoring the situation. Shut up guys, we have 30 minutes.
No, they're right here. We're too late. Who cares about bears anyways? Why should we waste our lives to save such pathetic animals? Do not be clouded with contempt. Bears and other members of the Order Carnivore are extremely unique and add rich diversity to our otherwise bland planet. Don't you remember what Miss Ishimine told us seven years ago in biology class? Do not be fooled by the name of the order. Not all of these animals are meat eating. In fact, there are exceptions like the giant panda and the bear cat. The rest are carnivores and omnivores. So, consensual animals as a whole are either herbivores, carnivores, or omnivores. Large carnivores like lions and bears feed on small animals such as fish and impala. On the other hand, omnivores either feed on smaller animals or plants. Herbivores, of course, are restricted to plant matter. Most members of the order carnivora can be distinguished by their strong, sharp claws and no fewer than four toes on their feet. Carnivores also have permanent canine premolar and molar teeth with cutting edges. Bears hibernate for seven months throughout the winter and fall. They do not eat, drink, or pass waste for the entire time period. Members of this order have a huge impact on human lives. Meat eaters are at the top of the food chain and keep their prey at a carrying capacity for the food supply. When humans exterminate some of these larger carnivores, they upset the balance of the ecosystem and make smaller carnivores very abundant. This creates an ideal environment for the spread of infection and increases the possibility of diseases being transmitted to humans. Did you know that the bear is a carnivore? Fact! Bears can run up to 40 miles per hour and can thus catch a running horse. The fastest known human can only run up to 27 miles per hour. We cannot kill off an animal that has a more athletic ability than us. Yeah, but let's not forget hippos, even though they aren't part of the order carnivore. They have more guts than us. Fact. Hippos give birth and breastfeed underwater even though almost all their predators live in the water. So stop being lazy and self-centered and man up. Imbeciles! Absolute idiots! I'm giving them one more chance. Hello? You're ruining everything, Dimitri. I thought you were my right hand man. I trusted you. I'm ashamed, sir. But I'll not let you down again. Do not let me regret giving you a second chance, eh? Good work, guys. Let's take a little break. Yes, only a short break. We need to be ready to save the other two animals just like shrews. Fact, shrews are always ready to look for food due to their low body fat. Shrews cannot go more than a couple hours without food. Missing a meal is a sure way to a quick death. A good night's sleep could prove to be fatal. So we cannot rest for more than one or two hours. For if we rest, the animals will be gone. One down, two to go. Their second target is the elephants. Sergei's henchmen are targeting a nearby water source. Intel suggests that they will poison the water, which in turn will kill the elephants. The elephants are from the order Proboscidea. They're part of the last living family of this order, and that's one of the main reasons we can't let Sergei's plan succeed. Thank you, and good luck. As always, this message will self-destruct in five seconds. Get ready guys, we're gonna go save the elephants. Put her on your sunscreen. The scientists and the henchmen make their way to the watering hole of the Order Proboscidea in order to meet their boss, Sergei. National Park. The Elephantidae family is the last surviving family from the Order Proboscidea. Do you think I care about that? All I want is my uranium. Who cares if a measly family of animals is destroyed in the process? Just tell me if our plans to kill them off will work. Well, the elephants are very dependent on the watering hole, as it is our last source of water. Poisoning them will for sure kill them. Once again, I urge you, let them be. The animals are very unique and make the world more diverse. Oh, he's one step ahead. 
ahead of us. This cannot have happened unless there's a traitor among our midst. Remember, be careful. We have to worry about the elephant's safety. Who cares about their safety? We should be worrying about ours. No, you do not know elephants like I do. Elephants are like superhumans. Fact. An African elephant can detect seismic signals with sensory cells in its feet and also hear these deep pitched sounds when ground vibrations travel from the animal's front feet up its leg and shoulder bones and into its middle ear. By comparing the timing of signals received by each of its front feet, the elephant can determine the sound's direction. That's more complex than human hearing. They are extremely important to our will. They are from the family Elephantidae and the order Proboscidea. In general, they are from the class Mammalia. Mammals have separate sexes and fertilization occurs internally. Mammals are viviparous, meaning their offspring are born live. Mammals, elephants, for example, need to nourish their young for a long time before their offspring are capable or capable of surviving. They are sometimes known as case strategists. This is the reason why they are slowly becoming extinct. Humans continue to take up space and are killing the elephants faster than the elephants are reproducing and parenting their young. Elephants also have some interesting mating rituals. They are polygenous, which means male elephants mate with more than one female elephant. These courtship rituals include two elephants intertwining their trunks and touching their mouths. This may lead to sexual intercourse where the ele male elephant mounts onto the female elephant. Elephants migrate because they constantly need a large supply of grass. Elephants travel in large herds so they devour an entire area of grass and move on. Elephants do, do take up a large amount of space so humans have to be careful by not intruding into their habitat. Elephants are important to humans because they are an essential part of the ecosystem. Some plant species can only germinate if they pass through the elephant's digestive tract. Elephants browsing and vegetation also affects the structure of habitats and influences fire patterns. Because of this, elephants are considered keystone species. They are essential. This creek, it has to lead somewhere else. Ethan, we have no time. We have to go right now. What about Agent Kevin? He can catch up later. If we want to save the dolphins, we have to leave right now. How do you know the last animals are dolphins? It was just a lucky guess. No, not your phone. The phone might be bugged. We need to go right now. What happened to everyone? Asian Kevin, the last animal your team must save is a dolphin from the order Cetacea. Here's some background on the order as well as the dolphin, so you know what exactly you're dealing with. Obviously, you probably don't think of dolphins as the representative mammals of the class Mammalia. This is true, and the animals that actually come to mind when thinking of the class Mammalia are animals like the tiger, bear, monkeys, and of course, humans. There are some unique characteristics that mammals share. These are exhibited in animals such as the dolphin, all the way to the bear. First, all mammals share three middle ear bones, the hammer, anvil, and stirrup. Second, all members of the class Mammalia have mammary glands that produce milk to nourish their newborn offspring. Finally. Animals like the dolphin, bear, and elephant have all have some sort of mammalian hair at some point in their life. Even marine mammals like the blue whale and dolphin have hair made out of keratin at some point in their life. The order Cetacea is endothermic and must use its own energy to control its body temperature. Dolphins, in particular, have a streamlined body with many different kinds of fins. Combined effect of this is that dolphins are particularly good swimmers. You may be able to identify the blow hole on the top of the head, and this is where they breathe in. Dolphins have a curved mouth, and this is why it looks like they have to be permanently smiling. The main reason that dolphins must be preserved is that they can be a positive force in the human world. In fact, they are already being trained by the military for rescue as well to detect underwater mines. Although there has been the occasional fatal dolphin attack, the dolphins are mostly friendly and have been used for therapy. They are especially effective for patients with depression. We also believe that there is a mole in the IMF and he's operating within your team. It would be a good idea for you to get rid of him before they 
top mount dimension. Why do you have the key? Uh, uh, I took it off one of the henchmen. Whatever. Look who it is. I knew I should have killed you when we first met. You tried to put a stop to my plans, but nothing changes. I will win, and you will lose. Ha 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 ha! Ha 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 ha! What kind of person are you? Killing innocent animals for no personal use. I despise people like you. You people are the reason that the world's corrupt and unjust. You people must be killed. Stop right there, you think? Justice? There's no such thing. It's nothing personal. It's just business. Kinda sorry, actually. Not really. Ethan! No! <laughs> ah! Oh, ah! Got me! Ah! My leg! Oh, my leg! My no. leg! My best, Ethan. But I have something to tell you. Come closer. No, even closer. Fact! Dolphins are the second most intelligent animals on the planet. Scientists have also concluded that they have the capacity for emotions. Hello, Agent Ethan. Your mission, should you choose to accept it, 